everyone, it's Riley with the Invading Species Awareness Program and I'm back on the trails again today and I wanted to share with you guys another really common terrestrial invading species. So I'm beside a European buckthorn or common buckthorn, those names are interchangeable. Um, this shrub like tree is super common across Ontario. It was actually introduced into Ontario for agricultural fence rows and um, gardening shrubs in the late 1800s and since then and again it's escaped to the natural world quite successfully um, it's virtually everywhere in southern ontario and other parts of ontario so if you want to come take a closer look to see what buckthorn actually looks like and some key id features so you'll see these smooth green leaves that are finely toothed um, a lot of the branches end in a thorn tip and then they start to produce these berry like um, berries here in the late summer so why buckthorn is an issue, um, again, like most terrestrial invading species, it forms dense thickets, um, weeding out and shading out all other uh, wildlife and native flora and fauna around it. So as you can see around me, this habitat is relatively open field habitat with a lot of nice hardwoods growing. However, after a while, once this begins to spread and grow more, it's gonna grow up taller and shade out those other trees um, and again, form that dense thicket or dense monoculture. It also is a big problem with agriculture as it can be a host species for a lot of different invasive insects and invasive diseases that have negative impacts on our agriculture. Um, so when it comes to preventing the spread of this really common terrestrial invading species, again, number one, we wanna make sure that we recognize what it is and know how to identify it, which we just chatted about earlier. Again, we also want to make sure that we're using proper and effective trail use, so staying on the trail, keeping our dogs on leaves on the trail, and cleaning our equipment and ourselves after we leave the trail before we go to a next one, so we're not a vector of spread. We also want to make sure that if you are using, or sorry, if you are disposing of buckthorn, you want to dispose of it properly, so you're not putting it into the garden waste for it to just spread again. And you can always report invading species to the invading species hotline, which is 1-800-563-7711, or you can report online via the EDMAPS database, which is the Early Detection and Distribution Mapping System, and all the information you can find on our website, which is invadingspecies.com. Thanks everyone, I'll see you again soon with some more terrestrial invading species.